Okay, you are watching and listening to the Fat Bidian Film Club and I'm assuming I'm Zan Azli. And I'm Aizil Azli. And there's still no local films in the cinemas. Yeah, uh, uh, that is the old films. That, yeah, you, you mean the world to me is still there? Yeah. Yeah, so go watch it. Right? Yeah. Uh, so we're, we can't review a film that's in the cinema right now. Uh, there's nothing interesting online either. Uh, I see James Lee on his Doghouse 73 Pictures YouTube channel. He's just pushing out links of his old films. Right. Is, it, is there a season to like a film season? I don't know. I guess so. There's Raya films, holiday Seems films. Like it, like. I, yeah. So maybe yeah. during Raya there'll be a lot of films that come out. Yeah, uh. Sunny, during our Raya episode will be like five films. Uh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. But we've got a topic that we want to talk about. Yeah. Uh, it's mildly related to films. Yeah, we're desperate already. La. Yeah. The Watson's ad. Uh. <laughs> So last week, uh, Watson's, the pharmaceutical company. Uh. Last week? This week? Yeah, this week. Oh yeah, this, oh wow, it's so topical. Yes. <laughs> this week. Yeah. So the past week, uh, there was a big hoo-ha about Watson's advertisement, uh, which was like 13 minutes long. Mm-hmm. Uh, for being racist. Uh. If, you're, if you're watching this on the day of the release of this video, it was yesterday, two days ago. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah, it was taken down the same day. It was taken down this morning. <laughs> no, no, last no, night, last night. Yeah. Well, it, well, yeah, on the day of recording. Mm. Well, yeah, two days ago. Yes. <laughs> uh, so if you haven't checked it out since it was, uh, it was they took it down on the same day. Yep. Uh, here's a brief uh, explanation. La. But the videos are everywhere. La. You can actually find the video everywhere. La. Yeah. Uh, the brief explanation is, uh, Prince? A rich prince. A rich? A rich not prince, uh, a rich businessman. No. Saudaga. Oh, is it? Mm. Okay, a rich businessman has dreams of a beautiful voice singing to him for the past three weeks. Uh, and he sends his people out to go and get him, like the the, the prettiest people who could have had that voice. Yes. To have that voice. So he yeah. From all around the world. He thinks he's premonizing, a pretty, premonitioning. Yes. A pretty woman. A pretty woman with a pretty voice. Pretty voice. Yeah. And so, princesses from so around the region came all around the world. Oh yeah, princesses from all you around the world. Masale also, who's actually not Masale because yeah. at the end she says, "I'm I am mixed." Yeah, very mixed. It's supposed to be a joke about <laughs> yeah. how mixed Malays yeah. refuse to speak Malay. Or something yes, like yes, that. yes, yes, yes. Yeah. So turns out all the pretty princesses. They, uh, they don't have that voice. That beautiful voice that it's he heard them. in his dream. Yeah. yeah. And then the, the right voice came. So he Cut. searches in the crowd. Cuts through the crowd, just like singing. And she finds this person singing, a, yeah, in a, in a covered, covered in up in cloth, yeah. And then open up, Sunny C. Black lady. She, she, she's black. She's, she's Malay with black, black complexion. Black, black skin painted on. Yeah, it's obvious, like black face lah. Yes. Like minstrel. <laughs> it, is, it, is, it is literally blackface. Uh? Yeah, it's literally blackface. Which yeah. was what caused a lot of uh, uproar. Anger, uh. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, well, technically, despite uh, being the black skin one, which like everyone freaked out like, whoa, black skin. Uh, then he even said, right, is it, uh, the lights are not on, is it? No lights, uh? no yeah. lighting. Uh? No lighting. <laughs> he ends up picking her also. Yeah. Because her voice is so beautiful lah, and yeah. he, she was supposed to be the one. Yeah, mm-hmm. but, 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 he's surprised to see that she actually goes and washes her face and then, she and then suddenly she turns fair. Yeah, super fair. And she becomes, he becomes very happy lah. Yeah. So he gets his cake and eats it too. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so it's, Watson's took it down and they said it it's based Initially, on Watson did not take it down. All the criticism started coming in, articles were being written, people were, were making noise, they didn't take it down. Right. They apologized first, right? Right. And you know, they took it down oh, first it down and then first. The, the apology Okay, but they took out. it down like really late at night lah. You know? Yeah. And uh, you read the apology? You should read the apology because it doesn't sound like an apology. It's a non-apology. Yeah, it's well, like... We apologize that you were offended. We will apologize that some of you were offended. Yeah. <laughs> but, but they don't see anything wrong with it. Yeah. Their and justification say, yeah. was uh, that it's based on an old folklore. Malay folklore. Yeah. yeah. Dayang Senandong. Dayang Senandong. Where the guy 
which happens exactly like that aside from all the the comic comic stuff mm-hmm. lah. But 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 you see, that is so long ago. Yeah. And these are values put onto values about beauty that was, you know, projected long time ago. Yeah, where the where the time when like. Yeah. What what surprises me is that this conversation is not being had by this pharmaceutical com- company, you know, because mm. like uh, this idea of fairness is like a big issue among uh, advertising agencies. How they how people still try to push like oh being a fair. A certain sense of beautification, yeah. beautify, yeah. beautiful. Yeah, you have to be fair. Yeah. You have to be fair. So the thing is, there there's an argument that oh culturally a lot of people still still um, believe that fairness is. It's being beautiful. fair is better. Mm. So, uh, but would that what would that be what you want your want to be brought forward into the future? Yeah, that's moving right. forward as a culture, moving yeah. forward as a as a community. Yeah. Do you want to be the do, are the racist parts the stuff that you want to bring forward? Bring forward, yeah. Yeah, don't we leave the racist part away? You know. Yeah. But no. Like we we try to better ourselves, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But they don't see it. It's like it's like they totally don't see the issue, you know. Yeah. You know. It's very strange. But come on lah. I mean, face it lah. In Malaysia, people are very racist, and 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 you know, dark skin, light skin thing is a uh, very prominent in our culture. You know, like it or not. Uh, and everybody likes to make jokes and make fun of things like that. People who are dark skin and people yeah. who are light skin. Yeah. 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 You know, and sometimes even those who claim that they're not racist and they are color blind and all that. Every once in a while, we see our, our friends. We still make those same jokes, even though we don't really mean it. But we still, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah. So, and it also surprises me that in the whole process uh, of the production and whatever, right? In the agency that created, that produced it, to Watson, to you know, there were no line of check and balance that would actually notice yeah. something like that. Because when I first watched it, I was thinking like, wow, that's a that's a very it's very good. I'm always very excited when I see brands being adventurous and mm. be like, oh long form 13 minute video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh wow, you go and tell a full story. Wow, you do crazy thing. Uh. So it's like wow that's adventurous. That's a positive thing. Yep. And then you watch the whole thing and it's like whoa you're so adventurous until like you yeah, don't care what came out. Uh. <laughs> Is it you didn't see what was coming out? Yeah. So it's like wow, blind trust into an agency or something, right? But don't they don't they see first? That's what I'm saying, right? Yeah, there is always it's crazy, it's crazy, WIP right? meetings, right? Yeah, yeah. So it's pretty crazy. <laughs> it's uh, always work in progress meetings, updates, and all that. Yeah. Uh, approval of scripts, approval of rough cuts. Yeah, yeah. I guess nobody. <sighs> What's interesting is they had like a. It's not like they didn't have. A dark skin uh, princess come up and try to win over the heart of the <laughs> saudaga. Yeah. They, they had they had an Indian actress yeah. playing a Siamese princess. <laughs> yeah, and uh, everybody was shocked by how beautiful she is. Yeah. I yeah. mean, like maybe technically uh, she's fair skin mm. for an Indian. Ah, you know, it's like those. It's like Stephen Curry lah. Light skin, light skin for black guy. Black guy. guy. Yeah. So it it uh, may, maybe like there's there's that 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 context also involved. Like oh, uh, normal lah. Like they are exposed to a darker skin uh, yep. race. Mm. It's just that they oh, will choose the lighter skin of the dark skin race. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> because yeah. Malay also the same thing, right? Yeah, because yeah. Malay is like this brown, right? Yeah, but to be beautiful, your fair complexion. Yeah. Hey, putih ni. It, it it's crazy. Yeah. 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 Kuputi, 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 kuputi. Not a sponsor. No, no. <laughs> yeah. So. Although it, we are looking for sponsors, but no. <laughs> okay. So so yeah, this racist thing is like we have to. I would assume that we are in a point in time where we would want to stop the perpetuation, uh, perpetuating racist stuff being passed down. You know, we yeah. do not want to perpetuate the racist no. part of cultures, lah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Mm, yeah, because okay, I'll tell you a story. Okay, once my, upon a time, my friend recently went to a, to an event. Where uh, there was like this face reading thing, okay, uh, it's it's a Chinese culture uh, uh, thing. Okay, reading the face based on your structure and that. One of the things that was brought up was, oh, you know, if you have uh, a unibrow, it's a sign of uh, aggression. You know, like terrorists. <laughs> that was like whoa. <laughs> 
Like, like when she was telling me, I was like, wow, if, 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 I, if I understood Mandarin, and if I were there, like, if I were there and if I understood Mandarin, I think I would ask, lah, like, wow, I, I got a bit of a unibrow or so. Like, <laughs> Am I a terrorist? Yeah, and like, like, what are you trying to say by like, terrorists having a <laughs> terrorist uni equals, a uh, unibrow equals terrorist. terrorist? You know, because some, some, she's basically talking about like how some races will have a hairy lah. Yeah, a hairier in the, above the eyes lah. It's like how they say girls who have hairy forearms are horny. <laughs> Is that a thing? Yeah. You see, if you see a girl who have hairy, who has hairy forearms, like very hairy, uh, they are like, like nympho or something. Mm. <laughs> so maybe we should make an ad about that lah. Hmm. Mm. Yes. Okay lah. Okay, oh, okay lah. Yeah, right. so... Uh, if you like this, please share it with everybody. If you don't like it, also share it lah. Yeah. Uh, subscribe to us or like our video or don't like our video or comment, right? Comment. Comment, mm. right? Tell us what you want us to do if there's no films to review in the cinemas. Yeah. So we're, we're guessing that. Do you have Do you have a film out? Yeah. Let's know. Yeah. Right. We yeah. will we'll, we'll, we'll feature it. Yeah. So we'll review it. <laughs> so yeah. So follow us on all our social media platforms at Fat Bidin or go to fatbidin.com for everything. You've been watching and listening to the Fat Bidin Film Club. I'm assuming I'm Zan Azli and I'm Izil Azli. Uh, we are looking for sponsors. So if you're a sponsor out there who likes our work, get in touch. <laughs>